Hi guys, let's come to another uh, tutorial. Uh, I'd like to show you how to create uh, NFTs and sell them on OpenSea. Um, so this tutorial is basically going to show you the basic tools of AI and images in which you can create your own NFTs and sell them out. So I'm basically going to go now to OpenSea. This is what you need to do if you're going to go into this faction of um, selling NFTs and collecting and, and distributing them. So if you're into NFTs, most likely, excuse me for that, um, you want to connect your, your wallet, which is your MetaMask wallet. Cool. Once it's connected, then you go to, like you'll notice that I have like a ton of uh, a, a, this thing, uh, tool, this thing, uh, NFTs that I've created. So I want to create um, a new one. So I'm basically going to go uh, to my uh, collections and I'm going to say in this collection, I'm going to open up uh, Strange Wolf Die Collection. These are really cheap. These are like for under uh, $5 each. So these are cool ones to have. There's only a hundred of them left. Um, go out and get them. Um, so to add an item, I'm just going to click I add. And obviously, you gotta have your sign in to uh, add item. And I have my creation, which is here, and I created it on Star AI, Starry AI. So it's got create dot Starry AI, or you can just go Starry AI on Google, and you'd pick it up. Right, so this is one of the tools and you get credits if, if five credits every day to create AI tools and stuff like that. So uh, here we go, I'm gonna, I'm gonna create another one. So I wanna go uh, Orion and I wanna say from my text, I wanna make it like um, uh, wolf predator. Uh, wolf predator on Mars All right cool I want to add my styles so I want to put a cinematic 4d uh, that let's do that uh, you can choose whatever you want here click X and then what we want to do is we want to go to create and this will cost me two credits so obviously you get five credits almost every day so like you can come here, you can buy credits if you want. Um, but basically every day you get like five credits. So you can just create like two a day. So this is one of the ones that I created. So I'm gonna go ahead and download this one. Um, and I'm gonna download that, cool. And then I wanna create this NFT. So I'll go here and I'll say cool, open. And I'm creating the World King NFT. So, Wolf, Ice Wolf King. So I'm gonna call it Ice Wolf King. And, so you, you wanna provide a bit of description. I usually leave my blank, but obviously, uh, this helps uh, in the sale of this thing. So um, if you want to add that there, you can go ahead. Uh, right here, you don't want to choose Ethereum, you choose Polygon because then it's free. It's completely free then on Polygon. If you choose Ethereum to start selling, you need an Ethereum gas price. And if you don't know what gas price is, you should Google that up. So I can create as, as many as I want. I usually create like a hundred because I'm going to be doing this like almost every day and see like a number of months can be minted and no gas to you cool that's awesome so what you want to do is create and then obviously traffic light stuff um, the normal verification stuff once you do create let it wait for a second so if I go back here I'll notice that uh, wolf predator on Mars as is in progress of being created that AI has been creating that there um, so cool now that I've created my NFT on uh, OpenSea and I've connected my MetaWask wallet 
yeah then I can now go and sell my NFT which is whatever price I want to sell it to so I usually sell it at uh, 0 0.03 which is like around eight dollars but that's usually you gotta keep it below your price so I'll say three five so that's not so bad um, so I'll make it three one that's about nine dollars right so I'll go there I'll put it off for listing and I'll say cool I want to list this and I want to sign into my wallet my metawask wallet into the protocol sign it in there and then cool now I've listed my NFT for sale and now that you notice the NFT is currently 100 NFTs for nine dollars at each so if you really want to go and see where your nft has appeared it'll take a while usually i've created like a ton of nfts um it'll usually take a while to pop up but this is basically the um collection that i'm working on it's called sigma dia wolf uh wolf dia um and i'm creating a ton of nfts on this year so this is basically one step and this is actually quite cool too because you could basically create whatever you want to create on this here and at most uh, if I want to download say like that one I got it as a predator wolf so I want to create another one and I'll say add an item and I'll say that one there and I'll call it predator wolf And then you try and sell your your NFTs for a low price, so that um, make sure you select the blockchain polygon because obviously you can note you notice that my account, uh, which I'm not going to show you the this thing, but it's basically almost uh, it's basically free. All you got to do is just uh, connect your wallet almost all the time uh, to confirm the transaction. So you'll always have to sign the transaction to be confirmed, so that when a sale actually occurs you can be able to withdraw that amount into your wallet All right so I've created predator wolf uh, NFT here and now that I see predator wolf NFT now there's no details because I didn't add any details so I just want to go sell I want to sell a hundred of them all of them and I want to make them at 0 0.0031 right and put them there complete selling sign notice that the metamask pops up here and cool go down sign cool i've now listed my nft and then if i go to view my nft you'll notice that it's basically all over there it's already for sale now on the market so if i really wanted a link to uh, this thing I just go to um, share I'll say copy link and I'll just open it into a new tab and you can share and sell your dial link on any other thing so if I go to like uh, incognito one and I'll note you'll notice that on OpenSea um, we have dial work for sale and sale ends at uh, in a month from now and yeah guys support like if you'd like to get uh, some of my nfts that's cool because usually what i do is i try to create unique ones um and i usually have like one um the other ones uh some are artistic some i make from scratch some i make from ai tools um but obviously publishing rights and everything once you sell them, only you will be able to, because the AI creates it, it's only one of a kind and it's unique. So I've created a hundred of them. I don't want to create too much of them to overcrowd uh, the, this thing. So it has to be like a limited amount of features in there. So that's basically it. And if I go back to my collections, see, I'm not in, in connected there. So I, that was incognito mode. And if I go here, um, and then we can look at other things and as you keep doing this and you keep listing and selling you usually get rewards like I've gotten two rewards from OpenSea um, 
in which uh, they go under if you go under your hidden page uh, so in OpenSea you don't create an account you need a MetaMask wallet so you need to download the um, basically the extension for MetaMask right uh, so if you go to uh, if you Google search MetaMask um, you'd usually come up with the extension install the extension accept it and you'll be able to see uh, what you want to do with that there I own a couple of NFTs it's quite a lot of NFTs um, this one's most of my favorite I'm selling it right now so only 17 hours left and this is a royalty NFT to Diplo uh, don't forget my love and I'm selling it at 0.4 uh, Ethereum which has a royalty payout of 0 0.004 so as long as you hold this yeah all royalties from the song from streaming will be paid out into your account so I'm, I'm basically selling this one now because I purchased it when it was low and this is the current value of it is actually 1.4 so I bought it for like super cheap when it came out I bought it for like uh, 0, 0.0 um, uh, 0 0.01 uh, so sorry uh, 0, 0, point, 0 0.1 and I uh, s now I'm selling it for that price and if you look at all of the other ones there's some that are much more higher that I designed myself which took a lot of time and work that's why I put them into a higher density of um, sales so basically that's how you want to get started and you can move on and then you can look at your collections and then start seeing what you want to do is try to create like a nice collection base and then you know trying to get some info but that's basically it cheers guys see you in the next video